Oh. Remember we used to do this in school? <laughs> I never did that. I did. <laughs> okay. Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. We will uh, be doing haunted dolls caught on camera. Oh my god. And it's dark. It's like 11.10 right now. It's the best time to watch it. Is it not? Yeah, it is. Oh. All right, guys. We're doing it for y'all. Like, share, comment, subscribe. We're going to start the video. Oh, sorry. I was thinking. From so puppet cool. master to child's play huh? the more recently popular Annabelle, dolls have made quite a creepy Wait, name for high? themselves. In fact, it has come to the point where we really don't need any scary yeah. stories or videos to make dolls frightening. Many people can simply walk into a room with a doll and suddenly feel uneasy. Mm -hmm. Just in case you didn't already fear dolls enough, though, here are 15 haunted dolls caught on tape. Number 15, The Angry Doll. This video has been on YouTube since as early as 2009 and has been shared and talked that. about countless times. Oh, it's just such a convincing and scary video that no doll list would be complete without it. This young girl is holding a large doll, which appears to be a quinceanera doll, which is a doll given to girls at their 15th birthday celebration. The dolls are dressed to look similar to the teenager receiving them, and are meant to symbolize the final toy the teenage girl will receive before becoming a woman. The doll is wearing a very extravagant dress as well as a tiara. The girl holding the doll is speaking Spanish, but she seems to be saying something about the doll being ugly. The doll quickly moves its head towards the girl and the person holding the camera alerts her. When Once the young girl notices yeah. that the uh -huh. doll's head has moved, she throws the doll down and screams. <laughs> Unlike in some other videos, the girl doesn't laugh at all and there isn't even a clear smile on her face. Real or not, something clearly happened here that yeah. genuinely terrified her. It's a I see, no, I have awesome. seen that. <laughs> Burn! I I'm moving it. out of that house that night. I have seen it like last year. Hell right no! That house is getting burnt down. I, bro, I, I've seen too many movies. I, I couldn't, I couldn't do it. Hell no! That dog just looked at her like she's like her ugly. She said, "Snitch, what?" <laughs> Run oh it one God. more time. Nah, that's... She ready. Makes you a happier person. Uh-uh. So if you're generous enough to like this video, then thank you, because it really helps us out. You welcome. Number 14, Possessed Barbie. Mm. When you think of haunted dolls, you probably picture a cracked porcelain doll with dead eyes, or a rotting away baby doll with an eerie laugh. Like some of the previous entries in this list, it's hard to take the beloved and beautiful Barbie and see it as creepy. This video will make you think twice about that mentality. Really, any object can be haunted by a strong enough spirit or entity, so leaving Barbie out is just wrong. This little girl is having a great time playing with her two dolls, talking in different voices for each of them. A male voice calls from another room and the child responds. As she turns back to her Barbie, not a second passes before the doll sharply turns its head towards the child. The little girl immediately throws the dolls down, screams, and nearly falls backwards. there and there's no information on what became of this haunted doll or child number 13 was the neck broken i it could it could have was a baby doll made with the old technique of using i feel like i feel like it was <laughs> it was one of those moments where the doll like the neck i don't know something like happening it just snapped the other yeah, way it looked, it looked like the doll my head might have already been broken yeah and, it, and it did when she it, maybe if she pulled the strand that would have made it yeah, no. I don't know that. <laughs> Yo, that shit crazy. Clear. Everybody. Yeah, sawdust, glue, cornstarch, resin, and wood flour. They were popular during the 19th century, but production ceased when plastic became the popular material for toys and dolls. 
Therefore, it's clear that the composition doll featured in this video is at least 70 years old, and possibly even older. According to the description for this April 2016 upload, the owners purchased the doll at a flea market and were given little information about the antique. The doll allegedly did not begin to move until the couple placed it on their chaise. In addition, the owners did not believe in ghosts, so they are astonished by this evidence. No, I'm good. That's why I didn't tell you nothing about that doll. With how old Hold and damaged on. this doll is, the slow and convincing movement is truly... Did you see the, the mattress movement? The slow and convincing movement is truly horrific. From... Number 12. I don't know. That, that's... The short and simple video shows something quite unsettling. The owner of the doll decided to leave a camera rolling on two separate occasions when they left the house. While they were gone over several hours, the doll moved its hands constantly. While the movements are slight, they are very visible and very disturbing once the footage is sped up slightly. I don't know if moving it. Yeah, it could be someone in the back moving it. Nah. I'm not convinced! Mm -hmm. The broken and old appearance of the doll only adds to the creepy aura. Apparently, this doll is over 100 years old, meaning that it's had quite a long life and likely countless owners or spirits that could likely be haunting and manipulating it. Number really? 11, a new gift. Some children often believe their toys to be alive or have feelings. In fact, it's quite common for kids to believe that their toys get jealous of one another. If you believe in these haunted dolls, to... this video could be proof that toys really do become envious of other playthings. This video was uploaded sometime in 2009 and features a mother recording her daughter receiving a new toy. Before the video begins, a short explanation reads that the mother didn't notice anything at the time, but upon reviewing the clip later, she noticed a candle rolling on the desk behind her daughter. She apparently showed the clip to her son, who pointed out that the doll moved its right hand. The little girl is excited about her toy and tells her mom she wants to name him Lovable. The mother questions this name choice, and at that exact moment, the doll's hand moves slightly but clearly. The candle, in response, rolls away from the doll despite the doll having not made contact with the candle at all. What's his name? Lovable. Sure his name isn't like Fred or Henry? How do you not notice that? For the remainder of the short video, the doll doesn't move an inch. And since this video has been re-uploaded to several channels, it isn't known if there was ever an update. Number 10, The Doll on the Shelf. This video was posted in October 2011 and starts out innocently. Three children are sitting around a table while playing around. A young girl begins to time herself while she stacks cups in a quick pace game. The other two children stand by and watch. In the excitement of the energetic game, no one seems to notice the little doll on the shelf behind them. The doll was laying down when the video began, but as soon as the young girl begins to stack cups, the doll slowly rises to a seated position, similar to the way you would imagine a corpse rising from its coffin. Once in its new position, the doll doesn't seem to move again and peers motionless over the room. That's so crazy. <laughs> The description for this upload explains that whoever recorded the video did not notice the doll while filming, but saw it later when reviewing the clip. The uploader also states, I am very worried and cannot figure out how this happened. If you have any suggestions on what to do, please message me. I have put the doll away in an old barn I have. There are no, no updates burn it. the latest videos on this channel. Burn and it. will likely resolve itself. Or the original uploader decided to keep any haunting information off the internet. <laughs> Number 9, Sherry's Collection. Despite so many people having such a grave fear of dolls, there are a few rare people in the world who love the lifelike toys. 
This video allegedly shows the collection of Sherry Schoon, a doll collector recording a short video to show off her impressive and slightly unsettling assortment of dolls. The dolls range from baby dolls to porcelain dolls, with a sprinkle of purposely creepy dolls. There has to be at least a hundred dolls visible in this video, as childlike creepy music plays in the background. While Sherry showcases several dolls standing on one side of the room, the camera pans over a you gotta be some type of crazy to have that many dolls looking at you. Nah, I couldn't do it. <laughs> you wake up in the middle of the night because you heard a noise. And they and all now you looking see at this, you. Yeah, it's like, dude, no, bro. Then you go girl, to the bathroom no. and they in the bathroom. I, here's a, fun, a funny story. Our grandmother, um, my grandma, she used to always have uh, dolls in her bathroom. And... And the visitor's bathroom at that, it was this pink bathroom. She had lace curtains. And we used to feel so weird just going to pee because we felt like the dolls was just staring at us. It creeped the hell out of us. And ever since then, we just don't fuck with dolls like that. Like, mm -mm. I don't even like dolls like that. Not even for when I was a child. So you don't want the chubby doll? Yeah. <laughs> what if I get you a, a Chucky doll? No. You wake up. <laughs> you wake up one day to Chucky. Here, <laughs> right next to you, say, "I love you." Very you Zero fucks do they give? Invade your personal space. That's what they would do. <sighs> Short baby doll in a red and black dress. So what happens quickly? The doll's right arm clearly switches from a no-reach position to a downward point. They look like they faking. Oh, shit. It could have got, like, rest she or whatever, and then... She to notice this as she goes about showing off her dolls, although she must have noticed later as it is pointed out in the title and description of the video. Again, while most of us would have set fire to the doll and ran for the hills, Sherry doesn't seem to have an issue with it. In fact, in accordance to some of her other uploads, she seems to have a particular interest in creepy or haunted dolls. Nothing wrong with having a unique hobby, but most of us can agree we aren't brave enough to fill our homes with haunted dolls. Number 8. Spunk Flunk In August 2015, vlog YouTuber Spunk Flunk was challenged by a viewer to purchase a haunted doll on eBay and keep it for as long as he could, as well as feature it in some upcoming videos. Spunk agreed to the challenge and purchased the doll. They took several photos and videos of the doll over the next couple of months, but nothing interesting seemed to happen until October 2015. Spunk was posting a quick vlog asking viewers to follow him on Google+. Plus. He had the doll in the background and in shot as part of the challenge. As he talks about needing help from viewers, at about the 29 second mark, the doll's right hand moves slightly. Spunk claims he didn't even notice this until a viewer pointed it out in the comments. Um, click add to circles and then just click following. That'd be awesome. It'll only take like a few seconds and that'll get me to 1,000 followers probably within a, you know, like five to six days. And then I'll finally have a little, um, click add to circles and then just click following. That'd be awesome. It'll only take like a few seconds and I'll get me to 1,000 followers probably within a, you know, like five to six days. And then after this video, Spunk began experiencing more and more strange events. The doll would move from the spots it was left. Other objects would be moved allegedly by the doll. He caught an EVP from the doll and in one video he seems to be possessed while holding the doll. During the EVP session, the app he uses works as a gateway to apparently allow the doll to communicate. Spunk asks if she's a ghost and she says, not a ghost. At one point, in an agonizing voice even begs, free me. Well, over a year later, after countless menacing events related to the doll, Spunk decided he didn't need the negative energy anymore. He sells the doll on eBay, but does one more EVP session in the car before shipping it off. Although it's unclear what the EVP app says, it sounds like sell and goodbye. Number 7, The Nutcracker. Man, the Nutcracker that was fake. made in 17th century Germany. 
where they were modeled after soldiers. As the years went on, the design changed, as did the attire of most soldiers. The wooden dolls are said to be good luck totems, and their teeth allegedly keep away bad spirits. Okay. However, in this case, we aren't so sure if that defense is working, as an evil spirit could possibly be attached to this nutcracker. This video of a traditional nutcracker has over 100,000 views, and it isn't because it's adorable. The original Dang. uploader claimed that this doll was in their family for over 400 years, and it was always rumored to be haunted. As more of a joke than investigation, the current owner decided to record the doll when no one was around. In this minute-long video, the figure closes its mouth, shakes back and forth, and even completely turns around. While this toy is moving, a dog seems unsettled by the actions of the doll. Of course, the yes, interesting yes. fact here is that it's a common belief that animals can see spirits in realms that humans cannot. Which is true. Using this presumption, I can infer that the small dog is seeing the spirit manipulating the figurine. <laughs> this clip has been sped up slightly to make the movements more visible. Number six, Kablam. Here we see another lover That's of dolls, creepy. specifically haunted or creepy dolls. Kablam is a vlog style YouTuber that collects dolls, most of which are allegedly haunted. In several <laughs> videos, Kablam introduces to us these haunted dolls and tells us a bit about them. In one of these videos, uploaded in August 2015, she introduces us to two of her dolls. Meanwhile, a blonde doll in the background can be seen moving slightly throughout the video. At first, it seems like the doll is just slowly moving or slumping over due to gravity. When paying close attention, however, the doll doesn't just slowly fall forward, it moves back and forth in position. Dolls, if not a bunch of them, have some sort of an energy to them. And that it's not the best kind of energy that, you know, is a good thing to have around. And that just kind of makes me a little bit... Furthermore, Kablam addresses this movement in another video. She explains that she notices the doll's movements in the previous vlog, so she sets up her camera to see if she can catch the doll moving without anyone in the room. During this short clip, the doll does visibly move. It seems to bend at the waist and stays in that position for the remainder of the clip. Kablam updated that she later rehomed all of the dolls to viewers that were interested because she couldn't handle the negative energy she believed they carried with mm -hmm. them. I'm Number that. five, facial changes. Man, I think we're overreacting to this y'all. Which ones did you guys think are real? Um, I, I think know. some of them may be real because I've had a paranormal experience myself. Uh, we can make that in a separate video, but um. Uh, I feel like some of them may be real, and I feel that spirits do are they are real, and stuff does happen like that. And if you don't think it, it's probably because you hadn't experienced anything like it yet. Regardless, but I feel like it's real. Nah, they look fake to me. I feel like someone in the background was like moving certain dolls and like some of them. Yeah, experience. I'm not saying all of them was real, but I'm saying that there was some that. Nah, and that and that app that yeah, was trash that, was, yeah. Th that could be anybody talking and then just no, yeah, uh, disguise it, or, their or, voice or it, or it could be like a, a auto operated um voice speaker thingy on the app exactly that nah, you, I, don't, I don't believe it that's not true that's but anyway you guys like share comment subscribe and we'll see you in our next video oh before we go don't you want to um your website my website is www.jelanillc.com. Go mm -hmm. ahead and check it out. I am wearing my bubble yum right now. And go ahead and check it out. Let me see if you oh, like you it. Are. I and bye. Peace and out. Peace be the journey. Just